What's an easy, simple genetic test to do to see if you're at increased risk for heart disease? We all have a thing in our blood called lipoprotein A. About 20% of us have a lot of it. When we have a lot of it, it leads to heart disease. Why does it do that? Lipoprotein A is one of the cholesterol-like molecules, and it deposits cholesterol in the lining of our arteries. So it builds up plaque or hardening of the arteries. Secondly, it's irritating to the lining of the artery, and it causes it to rupture or tear on the inside. And then third, it also has a clotting molecule on it, so it clots our blood. So when it builds up the plaque, tears the plaque on the lining of the artery, then it puts a blood clot there, which is what causes a heart attack. So if you're one of the 20% of people that has elevated levels, it's important to know. It's a blood test. We just measure your level. We don't actually check the gene. We don't have a treatment right now for it. There may be some coming out in the next few years, but we do know that lifestyle plays a big role in lowering the risk from the lipoprotein A. Lifestyle meaning healthy diet, good exercise, trying to maintain an ideal weight, and not smoking. Those are the big things, taking care of blood pressure. Lipoprotein A is genetically determined, and so it's a dominant gene. By that, I mean if you get the gene, then you have a high level in your blood, just from one parent. If you get it from both parents, then your blood level is really high. Lipoprotein A is something that doesn't change. It's like blue eyes. I don't need to send a patient back to the eye doctor every year to say, oh, are his eyes still blue? Of course they're still blue. They stay blue all your life. The same with lipoprotein A. Once it's up, it's going to be up all your life. But there may be things you can do not to lower it, but to lower your risk if you have it elevated. And then finally, there may be some medications coming out in the next few years that will actually inhibit the effects of lipoprotein A that can help us. If you do have it elevated, uh, here we usually give you a little letter. You can give your first degree relatives like your parents, your siblings, your children, and they can be checked. So if you know you have it, you can start to modify your lifestyle earlier in life to hopefully to lower the, uh, the risk that you have from elevated lipoprotein A. Well, I'm Dr. Steve Kopetsky, a preventive cardiologist at Mayo Clinic. And after surviving two bouts of cancer, I tried to find out what types of behaviors people could adopt to avoid disease, avoid illness, and live a long life. To learn more about this topic and so much more, check out my book, Live Younger Longer, written by me, Dr. Stephen Kopetsky. You can find the book at mcpress.mayoclinic.org or wherever you buy books. Thanks for listening. See you next time.